hi friends welcome to my channel my name is PD and today we are going to see how to design a professional thumbnail using a free website you don't need to install any software just create your login and start designing your thumbnails same school so please stay tuned and watch the entire video don't skip and if you are new here please do subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon for latest notifications so let's start with so just open your chrome browser and open this canva.com site so this canva.com is a free designing tool and it is having a set of pre-designed templates and a lot of things you can explore it later so for today's demo we are just seeing the how to design a youtube thumbnail so in the search bar type youtube so you will see two options youtube thumbnail and channel art so just click on the youtube thumbnail so once you click you can see there are set of templates pre-designed template provided by canva so you can use it most of them are free so for the demo purpose we are just using the blank one so click on blank so it will open the interface in new browser window so once it is open you can see the template a list of templates and again in the menu there are other options as well like photos so which is again a set of photos pre photos provided by canva again there is elements so elements is having different shapes so these shapes you can use it in your thumbnail and again these shapes are customizable so you can change the background color for that shapes and you can add text into into that so it is very customizable so it depends again on your creativity how how you are going to use those shapes again there is an option to add the text and again it is having a set of predefined font combinations which you can directly use just click on it and replace the font and font colors again there is option uh, with predefined set of backgrounds you can use plain color as well or you can choose the image from the list uh, if you want to upload your image you can use this upload option so just click on the upload images and choose the required image so guys this was all about the features of canva basic features uh, we have on this design portal so let's jump into the actual design part so click on the background and choose the required background for your thumbnail so i'm just choosing this so to, to apply it just click on it and it will be pop up on your canvas board now just click on the text menu and you will see the set of font combinations so you can use it as per your requirement so I'm just choosing here the plain text so to add it just click on it and it will be pop up on your canvas and to change the text double click on the text label and rename it or add, add the required text again you can copy the same label so to avoid the repetitive setting just uh, use the shortcuts ctrl c and ctrl v which is a bit similar to the microsoft office shortcuts so you can use it so friends i'm i'm just adjusting uh, text here so let me prepare the text first so instead of youtube i just want to add the image of youtube here so let's crop it properly and delete the uh, youtube text and replace it with text so just want to make it go cool. i'm just adding the image so nothing else so this is not something professional guys but, <laughs> but just just for the demonstration purpose so how to add the image how to resize it how to edit the text so i'm just showing this nothing else so please bear with me so let me adjust the text first so 
resize all your text properly so instead of moving the individual text label you can group all the labels and move it in a one go so this is something cool so I'm adding here one branding image for my channel so you can add it just by clicking on it and resize it and place it somewhere on your thumbnail so I'm just placing in the corner So thumbnail is actually very important so if you are a youtuber you must be knowing the importance of thumbnail so if your thumbnail is not attractive so you won't get uh, user attraction and you you won't get a view actually so to get more views to your video you must have a attractive and professional thumbnail so again it depends on your creativity if you are creative and if you know how to create the thumbnail then you can design it properly so just to make it cool I'm just changing the color so this is all about thumbnails we're talking about the thumbnail so I'm just highlighting this thumbnail, thumbnail label as with a different color so that it should be focused and just to demonstrate how to add the different shapes and frames so I'm just adding arrow so let's search for the arrow so click on it so it will be pop up on your canvas so you can uh, rotate it so just rotate to point the professional so this is just for demonstration purpose nothing else so you can change the arrow color so just just click or select the arrow and from the menu you can change color of it so click on color panel and make it similar to thumbnail text so I think this is looking cool not professional but still for the demonstration purpose I think it is cool so please bear with me also we can change the background of your thumbnail so once your text is ready you can try different backgrounds so we just want to try this right also you can adjust the transparency of it so make it little transparent I don't think it is looking cool so let's check the plain color so it is again looking very dark I think the old one was good so let's switch back to the old one click on it I think this is cool also you can add different elements uh, to your background just to make it different so search for any different shape crop it properly to fit your background so drag it size properly and you can send it back just to make your text labels visible I know this doesn't look professional but just for the demonstration purpose I'm just telling you so how we can add the different frames how you can set it into the background how you can add just the transparency of it so this is all for the demonstration purpose so you can design it professionally so just bear with me so we, we have just adjusted the transparency now it is looking better 
so i guess we are done with the thumbnail now so thank you guys so once you are done with the thumbnail part you can download it so click on the download button so here you can see different file types so png jpeg so recommended one is the png so click on it so once you click your file will be downloaded so just to verify open the file so this is how your final thumbnail will look like thanks for watching